Giving your kids a tablet can be a headache because they're not cheap. An iPad mini, it's $500 plus, the standard iPad, $499. They're big, they're breakable. It's not a fun thing to have around the house, you're always worried. But now, this, the Pebble Gear Disney tablets coming to Big W in the toy sales and afterwards, these may be just the best kids tablets I've ever seen. Hit like and subscribe if you want to see all the cool gadgets and tech we get to see here at EFTM. We'll bring it to you right here on YouTube. But first, let's talk about these. These are $159 in the Big W toy sale. They are $189 after that. They're pretty bloody good. Now here's, here's, here's how I judge that. My kids are very lucky, they've got iPads. They use their iPads and we enforce screen time on those pretty strictly an hour a day and they've got to request time if they want more. These devices are out of the box built with parental controls. So I set this up in literally a couple of minutes. This is Harry's uh, Cars movie tablet. Um, a bit hard to see the screen there, I apologize. But basically here, this is an Android tablet that is fully skinned with Pebble Gear and Disney content. Pebble Gear is kind of the interface, it's the parental controls, and Disney is a lot of the content. Now it's very hard to see here. I'll just see whether I can increase the brightness on this. I don't think I can. Um, that's one of the things. They're not the most amazing screens. But here on the screen where it says Harry, you can just see around it a green ring. That green ring tells Harry how much screen time he's got left. If he's used half his time, it's half green. And when he goes in, um, he's, this is a cool uh, home, home animated back screen, all that kind of stuff. He's got the same indicator up here that tells him all the time how much time he's got left. Out of the box, here's how it works. You power on the device and you go through the basic settings and then it says a parent's email address. It actually tells the kids if they're setting up, hand it to your parents. A parent puts in their email. A parent receives the email, you get a, a four or five digit code, you put that code in and that validates that, you know, the parent and how they get in touch with that parent via the email. And then the parent sets up a child account. You give the child a name, the child picks an icon, and then you set up screen time. This happens by default in the setup process. By default, it gives them an hour a day, two hours on the weekends, and a limit between kind of eight, oh, I think it's 6 a.m. or 8, 8 a.m. and 8 p.m. You can narrow that time, you can widen that time, you can add extra time during the day, you can take time off, whatever you want in your rules, in your household, that's the way it works. And from there, they've got access to a tablet that has hundreds of things built into it. There is basically an app store for kids games that have no in-app purchases, they require no cost to buy, there is no account linked to this, there's no credit card linked, they can just download all these apps. It's all there for them to do. And look, they are fun, simple games. But my kids were like, oh my God, this thing has Subway Surfers or something, which is a you know cool game. I think Cut the Rope is on here. There's games that, that kids know and would have seen on other devices. But most importantly, this protective case comes with it. So in the box for 159 bucks, 189 after the sales, this case, which has the branding of it, um, is built in, which means it's protected. This is gonna protect it from the bumps and bruises of life. The other thing you can get is a screen protector. So these screen protectors, obviously they protect the screen, but they're also a bit of branding. Disney around the outside, and there's one for every different tablet. So there's three tablets, the um, Toy, Toys Movie, Frozen, and Cars Movie. Three of the best movies of all time. Cars, obviously, the best. Um, and you know, your kids just choose the one they want, and they get it based on the themes. I, this is also, there's also this uh, pouch you can get. Um, I might be 29 for this, 39 for this, either way, it's around that price. So you've got a carry case where the kids can keep their, uh, their tablet in, you've got the tablet itself, and you're spending under $200. I mean, honestly, under $200 for a tablet built specifically for kids is ridiculous. It's ridiculously good, it's great value, it's exclusive to Big W, um, and I just have nothing but good things to say about it. If you want me to tell you what's wrong with it, why it's only $159, yeah, it's not the most powerful tablet on the planet. It has cameras, not the best ones, and no, that screen, not amazing. But don't sit it side by side with an iPad and compare it, that's ridiculous. If you've got 500 bucks for an iPad mini, go and buy one, good on you. This is, this is not for that. This is for people that know their kids just want something to play with. You do sometimes just need your kids to have a bit of a play, get out of your hair while you do the dishes or you're at an appointment, whatever it might be. Um, I think this is awesome, big fan, love it. And uh, if the kids are really good, 
they can press the extra time button and you as a parent can enter the parental pin at extra time and reward them for maybe doing the chores. These are the Pebble Gear Disney tablets. Find them at Big W. Check out the big toy sale this month at Big W. And after that, 189.